Don't tell me I'm dreaming again. You know, for once, just once, it would be nice to have a decent night's sleep without waking up screaming from a bad dream at 4 a.m. Postcard pretty. Oh, perfect. I guess if I don't do something to save that egg, I'll suffer seven years of bad karma or something. It looks reptilian, but it can't be. It's much, much too big and... and... I don't much care for reptiles. Lucky thing the egg got caught between those roots. It's a long way down. I'm an artist, not a botanist, but I'm pretty certain this tree is dead. Or close to it. It's as dry as a bone. It'd probably snap right off in a second. Suffering we must endure. What? Why do you take such pleasure in torturing us? Torturing you? Who are you? We are the voice of all trees, the spirit of wood and leaf. You're a talking tree? No, a tree does not talk. At least not in your tone. The tongue of trees is the language of wood, root, and leaf. Who are you then? Like we said, we are the voice of all trees. Whenever an injustice is done, we must speak for the tree if we are present. It's the branch. I shouldn't have broken the branch off. Oh, what does it matter anyway? There is nothing more to be done for us. We are simply here to provide comfort in the final passing to Earth. We? I only see one of you. We are one with our host, as we are all one spirit, but Legion. Yeah, uh, thanks for clearing that up. We do not expect you to understand. You are human. What happened to the tree? Oh, the pain. As the battle raged, we... Battle? Between the mother and black chaos. She was only protecting her child, but it would not back down. And the force of their battle shook the mountain. The brook that fed us was led astray, and without water, we began to wither and die. What's the deal with the egg? Egg? What egg? Oh, of course, the child. Whenever the mother was absent, we were entrusted with the safety of the child. But now, withered and without strength, we can do nothing to help. We have failed the mother, and we despair. Our shame knows no bounds. Who are you again? We are the Wood Spirit. We come to all trees in the hour of great need to provide comfort and aid in the passing to Earth and to give a voice to those who suffer. Our time is running out as we speak. The passing to Earth is about to begin. Leave us now. What about the egg? Oh, it is too late. Without sustenance, we do not have the strength to bring it safely home. We have failed. 
and the earth will know our shame for all time to come. Are you always this glum? We are here because it is too late. The passing has begun. Leave us. Please. Isn't there anything I can do to help? Oh, we do not expect a human to come to our aid. Lose the attitude, okay? Just tell me if there's anything I can do. It is futile. We need water, but there is none. Not after the brook changed course. I'll find a way. Don't panic. We do not panic. Unlike you, we accept our destiny. If, however, against all odds, you do succeed, we will carry the child safely back into its nest. Do not make a foolish attempt on your own. It would spell certain misery. It's a nest, padded with large scales, very large scales. For some strange reason, I have a feeling I should get the hell out of here before the tenants return. This is interesting. I've never seen a scale this size before. I'll keep it as a souvenir. In my undies. That's so not appropriate. Fresh mountain water. Back in the real world, they'd probably charge 15 bucks a bottle for this. According to the, um, spirit. There was some kind of battle that split the rock and changed the course of the stream. It's a large, slick, and somehow disturbingly reptilian scale. It's the withered limb of a dying tree. I feel so guilty. I really do. I think I just made a funnel. Cool! I'm so proud of myself. This should do the trick. Talk about instant rehab. Hello? Hello? Leave us be. Are you okay? We find our strength returned, and so we have no time for idle conversation. We must drink and rejoice. Aren't we forgetting something? Listen, the song of ancient wood. Is it not sweet? Sweet, definitely. Yeah, the baby's probably ready to boogie down as well. The baby, oh, the egg. Thank the earth. We almost forgot. Uh oh. Uh-oh. 
It is you. You have come. You know me? April. Daughter. I have been waiting for you. Waiting? Why? Because it begins here, with you, as it always has. What do you mean? The breach and the mending, the pain and the joy, the end of the old and the dawn of the new. A different world. I am the mother of what is, but you, you are the mother of a future that may yet be. How will I know? How will I know what to do? I will guide you, and I will protect you as much as I can. But in the end, you are on your own. I'm afraid. You always were, my child, my daughter. This is probably not a good thing. 